Uh, greetings, Dennis Daniels here. Uh, this is OpenAI. This is the playground. This is not ChatGPT. And the reason I'm, I'm using this is because ChatGPT uh, may or may not actually be using the Codex model. And the Codex model is uh, the one that's being that's used or suggested for use in writing code. And you'll see this right here in the under the model. You'll see code DaVinci 02, uh, code Cushman 01. And yeah, these are all text. And each one has its own strength in terms of efficiency. Uh, I'm using code DaVinci 002. And one of the things that the documentation really emphasizes is that you, uh, that the more information you give the model, the more likely you are to get what you want. And you can see here, I've used a, a series of Python uh, quote strings to tell the application what I basically want. And it's, it is limited, but it did generate code. And more importantly, it generated working code. So I went ahead and copy pasted all of the text from the codex. And I uh, was able to um, I was able to get it to work. So I'm going to rename this file so there's no doubt that it's working. So it's going to be one output.txt over here. And I'm using VS Studio Code. So actually I can do no, I don't want to do that. I will go ahead and run this. And you see I get a, a little TK. Uh, TKIN or TKenter with no formatting and quite primitive. I don't actually know how to format TKenters, but here we go. So I'm going to type, What is your name? And I'm going to say, uh, George of the Jungle. All right. And now what happens? Nothing fancy, but. It's going to write this file out to one output. There it is. And George of the Jungle is the response. Now, uh, if I type a new name here, uh, Dory of the Sea, what do you think will happen? I click on Save, and it gets overwritten. So my little script. Um, my little script doesn't have an append in here to ask, keep asking names or uh, to keep writing new prompts. Uh, that's not, um, you can see entry delete right there. I don't know enough about T Cantor to understand exactly how to squeeze more out of this. Um, That will be for a different video. All right. Thank you for watching and happy coding.